What's up troopers, my name is Neil and today we're going to be showing off the brand new best weapon in Battlefield 2042. So before we get into this video, I want to tell you guys to make sure to subscribe to the channel. You guys have been absolutely killing it with all the content and we just hit 1 million views. So thank you so much for the amazing support on the channel. I am so grateful for you guys being a part of this channel. I really, really am. For everyone subscribing or just joining, thank you so much. And leave a like on this video. This weapon, what I'm going to be talking about in just a second, it was really good, but now it's extremely good why there was a problem with the weapons called the weapon balloon it was basically when you use the weapons had extreme spread and i was keep saying that this weapon was going to be so good after these weapons were sorted out so there wouldn't be insane spread and i tell you what i was damn right the weapon we are talking about today is the savar this is the weapon of choice i absolutely love it and what's so cool about it is it has a grenade launcher and that is what's so sick about it you can do some insane montage clips and you've probably already seen some in this video already me just jumping out of a plane taking out with a grenade launcher so amazing so this is the class setup i use for it right now i use this weapon right here i also did the pistol the mp28 with the med pen and honestly, I don't know why I'm using this. I use this one right here, the standard nades. The specialist I use is obviously the Sundance. I absolutely love her. She is perfect for aggressive gunfights. But anyway, let's get into the plus menu for the Safar weapon. So let's kick it off with the sights. So basically, this is the sight of what I love using. This one right here, the K8. It's absolutely amazing. It really is. But what's just so good about this weapon is it obviously has a 650 fire rate. And that's what's just so cool about it. Obviously, the firing modes, you can have it a single and full auto. But the thing is, what's really clutch about this weapon is if you tap fire you're going to stay so consistent and also i like to use this sight as well it is the 1.25 and also with a 2.5 so you can basically kind of zoom it out and kind of zoom it in if you really want to so it's really good for them long range and medium range gunfights now we're moving on to the ammunition so it does have a drum mag but this is the ammunition i actually really like using so obviously the damage gives you 55 accuracy is 33 range is 47 handling is 41 but what's really good about it is it gives you that recoil control reload speed and the rate of fire and i'll tell you what using rate of fire with a bad boy like this oh my it's deadly then for my second one i used the high powered this is only for 20 mag so it's a little bit low on the ammunition but it gives you a 60% of damage holy 60% that's mad and then also as well i actually have the drum mag it's a high power drum mag but the thing is as you can obviously you can tell if i just switch from between these two 41 to 26 so the handling is really really low and that is the problem with the drum mag yes it can be really good but the handling is super low and that is the problem with it so if you're not very good with recoil control i suggest you shouldn't use this one you should have it on anyway because you never know when you need it so these are the three i like using the standard issue the high power and then the high power drum this is the nade launcher what i like using this is the one what definitely gives you the impact so if any choppers or vehicles anything like that as long as you're on a certain good distance you can shoot this and it would explode in impact if you are really close it will actually bounce but a little cool tip for you guys if you have a friend with a riot shield and you see a bunch of enemies look at your friend with a riot shield be super close to him and shoot that need launcher and they will bounce back and it will kill an enemy i've yet to do it myself but i really would love to see one of you guys do it if you guys do do that please join my discord server where it's in the description below and send me that clip i would love to see that that'd be so cool just seeing a grenade launcher bounce from a riot shield and kill an enemy imagine destroying a vehicle that would be absolutely extreme please someone show me a clip like that it'd be absolutely amazing to see and honestly my troopers in the discord will love to see it as well so now on to the barrel so you guys kind of know me now the way how to play this game you gotta be kind of a bit more passive you could be aggressive but you're also a bit passive not super aggressive but just kind of that stable like oh i gotta be careful play style but the suppressor is so clutch because number one you can get some insane flanks with it and they won't even see you coming and that's what's really good about it yes it takes down the damage just a little bit but it doesn't matter because this gun is just so good in general 
Then I use this one. This is really good because this increases the range. Obviously, you get the 60% damage with the 48 accuracy with a range of 52, but you do lose a little bit of handling. You lose 10% of handling, but it's okay because when you're far away distance, you're not spraying a brain, you're tap firing. So that's what you want to do. You want to tap fire on far distance in general because that's the best way to perform in this game. So a long range barrel like this, tap fire, and you'll do the job. But anyway, troopers, that is the class setup for the Savar. Honestly, it's the, by far the best gun. Literally, SMGs were definitely the dominated class in this game. But now, finally, our assault rifle is taking king. Trust me, use it. Let me know in the comment section what you think about this weapon. You guys will have an absolute blast with this weapon. It's been one of my favorites before even the patch even came out. And now they fixed the bloom system. So now there's no spread. It's just absolutely amazing. I keep telling people in my stream, I said, watch this. So far, it's going to be by far the best gun in the game. And I was right. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully, this class setup helps you. Make sure to leave a like, comment subscribe for more class setup videos and more guide videos on the way and i'll see you troopers in the next video peace